Greetings, fellow classic TV fans. In 1966, a popular TV version of Tarzan starred Ron Ely and aired on NBC for two seasons, totaling 57 episodes. Unlike previous portrayals, this Tarzan did have his chimp companion Cheetah, but no Jane. He was also depicted as sort of a jungle-based crime fighter, having been educated, then getting fed up with civilization, and ultimately returning to his roots. Or should I say his trees? The series also featured his young sidekick named Jai. He was played by actor Manuel Padilla Jr. Manuel is recognizable from his many TV roles, having bit parts on Gunsmoke, The Flying Nun, Rawhide, and Bonanza. Ely was also no stranger to classic TV, having appeared on shows like The Many Loves of Dobie Gillis, Father Knows Best, The Courtship of Eddie's Father, and later on Fantasy Island, The Love Boat, and Wonder Woman. While playing Tarzan, Ron is reported to have performed all his own stunts, but unfortunately, this also meant he sustained many injuries. For example, he burned both his arms and legs during a fire scene and was bitten twice by a supposedly tame lion. He fell from a swinging vine separating his shoulder. He then fell from another vine, this time breaking the other shoulder. His injuries continued as he sprained both wrists and sustained three broken ribs, but based on the fixed air dates, filming continued. So there's no denying that the banged up Ron Ely surely did suffer for this part. And although he was playing Tarzan, this sounds a bit more to me like George of the Jungle.